Attack on Titan. That just came out with a live action trailer mm -hmm. for the movie. Now, if you don't know T Attack on Titan, I believe it started out as a manga back in 2009, which is a Japanese pretty much comic book. Then it got adapted into a anime, which was back in what, 2013, 2014? Yeah, it was, it was over a year ago now, anyway. So I think, yeah, about two years ago now. Yeah, and, um, and uh, that was First pretty season. awesome. And uh, it was a extremely popular in Japan, I believe, and, you know, in, in that area of the world. But another thing that was a little more also surprising... Very popular here. That's what I'm saying. It was, it was extremely popular here in the United States, where a lot of those don't quite catch on here. So it, it has a lot of international appeal. Well, they decided they were going to make it into a live-action movie, and the first real trailer, I think they had a little teaser trailer come out where you kind of see the big guy coming over the, the, the wall, but they gave you your first real live action trailer. Now, a little bit of a synopsis of the story is humanity. This is kind of like, a mid, imagine almost medieval times with a little bit of a steampunk element to it. Um, and all, all humanity, there's these giant things that like to eat humans have suddenly popped up across the world. The only way humanity survived was building these huge giant walls. And in, it's pretty much three rings. So outside ring, one middle ring, and then an inside ring. And one day, one of the titans, the giant monsters, gets over the wall. So the outside ring has been taken over. And pretty much that's where our story starts. You have a kid watching like everybody around him getting eaten, which they actually show in the trailer, which is very interesting seeing those giant um, titans reaching down. And they have these really creepy looks on their faces too. They're like always smiling. It's, it's they always have just a generic look. Like I, I think in the trailer they showed a lot of the smiling ones and you see a lot of that that sticks out to you. But you'll see ones in the show anyway that are like scowling or just have kind of a blank stare. They they just have random expressions for yeah, whatever it's... reason. But they eat people, like, ow, and, and swallow them. Well, not swallow them, yeah. chop them. Now, honestly, I was, I'm not sure how I feel about them going with a live action one for this. Like, it, to translate this, that it hasn't even completed the anime straight to live action, particularly with how much special effects they're going to need for this. Well, when, when you're looking at the trailer, it, it looks cool. But you can tell it's not quite Hollywood quality. Now, yeah. Hollywood, it's hard to match Hollywood anywhere else in the world. That is the movie-making machine that is, granted, American, but I'd say probably the best movie-making machine in the world is Hollywood. They have the highest quality of everything in terms of special effects and everything like that. So it's not quite Hollywood, but it still looked pretty good. Uh, the effects looked pretty good. It looked like they did show a little bit of the drawn stuff from time to time in the trailer mm -hmm. at least so i don't know maybe they'll do some interesting flashes to it like they did with like kill bill remember that had its whole mm -hmm. like anime sequence for for a little bit so we'll see how that goes um but it, it was cool but what i i think of and i think japan would be the good people to bring this out would, it goes back to the kaiju type movies you know the giant monsters the godzillas the king kongs the, the type of monsters like that yeah. invading the territory and who better than the japanese to have a giant monster invading. Yeah, and the special effects kind of looked like that um, for the Titans. Uh, a little bit looked like like at least the newer um, you know giant monsters that you see from uh, Japan, which I don't know. Like it, I guess it makes sense. It was still good enough, but it didn't. I wasn't sold on the realism the same way of like these look like flesh and blood people they don't really yeah uh, well uh, yeah i mean so there's going to be a little bit of, like i said special effects is going to be a little bit of an issue you're not going to expect top tier special effects out of this but i don't think you need top tier special effects in every single movie to make it good just expect not to see top tier effects and uh, that shouldn't bother you uh, the only other thing that might come off a little weird on screen is they do have these machines these what this is how they fight back against the titans they do have cannons and stuff but that tends not to work as well titans do have a weak spot in the back of their neck and if you slice into it you can kill them uh but the only way they can get to that height because some of them are two three four five six seven eight nine ten stories tall um is they have these kind of like 
packs on their side which shoot out these like grappling hooks and like drag them place to place and they yeah. kind of fly around and that might be like a little Spider-Man from the hips. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. The... That's a very good way to describe it. It's like Spider-Man shooting his web, but from the hips. So it's going to be interesting to see how that all plays out. Now, this movie is going to be in Japanese. Um, so I'm not going to watch it until they dub it over. But, you know, they'll dub it over. They, they will do that. I'll probably watch it beforehand. You will. You so. will. But I, I just think all in all, you're right. There might come into a little bit of a problem with how big the anime is and it's not even finished yet. How are they going to do a whole movie on it? But that makes me think that they're going to do multiple parts of a movie. And I have seen this work out pretty well. If you ever saw the death note movies, uh, mm -hmm. the anime was really cool, but then the death note movies were pretty cool too. So it can work. You just got to kind of rework the story to tailor it properly. So we'll see how it goes. I do want to see this movie when it eventually comes out and when it comes out dubbed, it'll happen. It always does. Yeah. It won't come out in theaters dubbed, <laughs> but uh, it'll come out dubbed somewhere or another. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. But I don't know. Let us know what you think. Have you ever heard of Attack on Titan? If you haven't, where have you been? Like that? Like I said, it was pretty big for a while. Um, so and are you excited? Netflix, so you can catch it on Netflix for sure. Um, so yeah, are you excited to see it? If you're not, if you are, let us know why. Because it's gonna be awesome. All right, don't let us know why. You, you're gonna be excited. You, okay, Are you scared about it because it's a live action off of an anime? How well is that going to translate with the super special effects and giant monsters? Come on, I don't know. Um, we'll see. Weird. We'll see. But hit us up, let us know, comments down below. Of course, at What's My Face on Twitter, Google Plus, and Facebook. Always good ways to get.